Good afternoon, good evening, YouTube. It's your man George Page coming to you live, live on YouTube. And before you have one Miss Anne Marie Crooks. Now, Miss Crooks is a is a bodybuilder, not pro, but you know she has competed in bodybuilding for quite for quite a time. But she's better known by another name as Midnight. Now, if you ever watch um, WCW back in the day, she used to be part of Harlem Heat. But before then, she was a, she was a female bodybuilder. Now, I'm about to say professional, but no, she was an amateur. Now, Miss Crooks was born in in um, Kingston, Jamaica. In September the 2nd of 1965. Now, after that, her family moved from Jamaica to the United States, where they live in, Southern, in Florida. Now, she was studying, she wanted to become an aeronautic engineer, but she decided to join the United States Air Force. Now, at that time in the Air Force, she was stationed in Germany, and after her time was up, she came back to Florida and decided to start her career in bodybuilding. Now, her first um, try at the sport was at the Miss Sunshine State in 1992 where she took first place as a heavyweight after that she she continued when she competed in uh 93 in miss florida and took first place there then her next big show was nbc nationals which took fourth in the heavyweight division and she also competed in the north american championship and took second place in the heavyweight division she competed in some more shows 94 nationals and 96 nationals and the 98 US, um, USA championships he took fourth now after a few years in competing as a as a amateur bodybuilding her last show was the 98 NBC nationals we took eighth place and during that time she was studying and um, also training with the WCW power plant now power, and originally remember WCW had a you know a place in you know they mostly was originally in I think it was Atlanta, but also had a place in Florida. But she was training with them instead of becoming the character as we know as Midnight. Now in 99, she joined WCW and became part of Harlem Heat. As you remember, she was their valet slash bodyguard. Now Midnight wrestled in quite a few matches. She wrestled against um, such as at the time, there was, was a female bodybuilder by the name of um, Christine, uh, Christy uh, Wolf. She wrestled against her and also wrestled against um, Miss Jacqueline, or aka Miss Jackie back in the day now as you know there was like quite a few I think in the good part of the um, late 90s early 2000s there's quite a few female bodybuilders that transitioned to wrestlers I know I said for, for Christy Wolf also there was um, the late Nicole Bass and Joey Lowell aka China you know now Joey and, um, and um, Nicole were both in, up in uh, um, WBF at the time but WWE slash now and um, you know they, they did pretty good as you know, really represented female bodybuilders in wrestling. Well, after those, after a couple of years, she retired from wrestling in 2001. So he decided to settle as a realtor in, in Florida and get married. Now, Miss um, Crooks has is one of the tallest women in in female bodybuilding. Now she's she's either second or third to the late Nicole Bass. Nicole Bass was like about six one six two, and the thing with about women who are that tall, it's hard to get muscle on the body because it's you know it's just so much length and you know especially if you're taller and more maybe about skinnier, you don't have a lot of fat. But amazingly, if you see this, Miss um, Crooks was able to get on with quite a lot of few muscles on such a long and tall frame. I was a big fan of Miss Crooks back in the day, and uh, I thought she was a, just a, a true Amazon of female bodybuilding. And there's so few of them now. But anyway, you know, she's, like I said before, she's settled down. She's a realtor. She's married. And, you know, she's, you know, I don't, I don't think she's do too much for the sport like many bodybuilders do. Some stay within the sport, you know, helping out, doing stuff like that, judging or whatever else. But she found her niche as a realtor, and she's happy with her life as a as a wife and maybe even a mother, you know, as we know. But as you know, she's I would say a legend. And I was I was kind of feel that one of those people that never really got a shot to the big time becoming the IFBB pro. Well much respect to Miss Crooks and much respect to any women in the sport. So, you know, good luck. It's your man George Page. Like, subscribe. Don't like, don't subscribe. I'm out.